Welcome back. We're at 13 minutes after the hour. A Memphis man holds on for answers decades after his sister was killed. Now, detectives are now reopening the once cold case, hoping someone will do the right thing and come forward. Greg Hurst talked to the family of Gloria Johnson in today's Manhunt Monday. She was every person's dream sister. Um, Gloria was great. That's how Michael Johnson remembers his big sister. Strong, assertive, but caring. Michael was only a child when his sister disappeared. It was a day no one in his family will ever forget. Memphis police say October 6, 1974, 19-year-old Gloria Johnson's family reported her missing. Ten days later, the Memphis Fire Department responded to a grass fire at what was, back in the 70s, YMV Road, just north of Fields Road and Hickey Street in southwest Memphis. When firefighters put out the fire, they found Johnson's body buried under the charred debris. Homicide investigators were called to the scene. My mom got a call to come down and, you know, look at a body. This is one of the worst things that a parent, much less a mother, would have to go through. According to detectives, a medical examiner ruled Johnson's cause of death to be multiple stab wounds. She was stabbed several times uh, in the eye, chest. Michael believes his sister knew her killer. He says after the murder, the killer set the field on fire to cover up the crime. I can only imagine what my mother felt all those years to lose her firstborn in that way. Now, the Memphis Police Department's cold case unit is putting a new set of eyes on the 48-year-old murder case, hoping to put a killer behind bars and give Johnson's family some long overdue justice. I love you. I miss you. If you know who killed Gloria Johnson, you're urged to call Crime Stoppers at 901-528-CASH. Crime Stoppers and Johnson's family are offering a $12,000 reward for information leading to the arrest of Johnson's killer. Remember, all calls are confidential. And if you have a story that you would like for us to profile on Manhunt Monday, email us at manhuntmonday at wreg.com.